You're not asking for my permission. But we would like your blessing, Papa. I can't believe my own ears. My blessing? For what? For going over my head. Impossible. At least with Saito and Mato, they asked me, they begged me, but now if I like her or not, she'll marry him. So what do you want from me? Go on, me wed, and turn out my beard and uncover my head. Tradition, oh, they're not even asking permission from the papa. What's happening to the tradition? Oh, one little time, I pull out a thread, and where has it led? Where has it led? Where has it led to this? A man tells me he's getting married. He doesn't ask me. He tells me. Oh, but first, he abandons her. He is not abandoning me, Papa. I will send for her as soon as I can and marry her. I love her. Love. It's a new style. On the other hand, uh, they, they decided without parents, without the matchmaker. After all, did Adam and Eve have a matchmaker? Yes, they did. And I suppose these two have the same one. Her gold wing over my head. Unheard of. Absurd. For this, they want to be blessed. Impossible. I'll lock her up in a room. I couldn't. I should. But look at my daughter's eyes. She loves him. Tradition. All right. You have my blessing and my permission. Oh, thank you, Papa. You don't know how happy this makes me. What else could I do? Thank you, Papa. Uh, thank you, Papa. Oh, Golda, what will I tell Golda? Another dream? Perhaps tell her something? That I'm going to get visit rich uncle? Something like that. Ah, please, Pershing. I can uh, handle my own life. <laughs> Golda, Golda! Ah, Golda. I've just been talking to Pershing and Hanu. Well? Well, they seem to be very fond of each other. Well? Well, I have decided to give them my permission to get engaged, and I need to go inside and, uh... What? Just like this? Without even asking me? Well, who asks you? I am the father. Who is he? What does he have? He's a pauper. He has nothing. Absolutely oh, come on. Nothing. I wouldn't say that. 